Okay, we're gonna target on short circuit and open circuit today, which are really confusing usually. So, this is an oral circuit, you've seen it before. There are 5 milliamps of current here, and we do this by Ohm's law V equals Ri, and it's 1 kilo ohm. 5, oops, let me do the I as it is indicated here. The current is 5 milliamps. So hopefully you learned this before. Coming here, the uh, passive convention is what we're going to use throughout the course. And basically, given this 5 volt power supply here, there are 5 volts up here. And I'm going to indicate the 5 volt drop across the uh, resistor with an arrow with a plus here and a minus here. And if I need to make an arrow, it's going to be in this direction. So the current's going down through the resistor, through the 1 kilo ohm resistor. The voltage drop is in this way, so it's 5 to 0. You can see this as stairs going up or down. Now, this is all we knew before. What's new today is that uh, if I have a short circuit, the resistance is 0. A short circuit means there is a wire from here to here. There is no resistance. If there is an open circuit, so between here and here, there is no wire. This is not even um, an active circuit, circuit at this point. First thing you should see is, because the current cannot jump over here, this current is zero. And this current could, but if there were any current here, it would go through this node, and it would go through here, but here it stops, and therefore this forces all these currents in this circuit and in the other circuit to be zero. You absolutely need to remember this, that there is no current. Okay, the next video we're going to talk about the voltage differences here.